Hi, first quarter of uh, 2014 and uh, once again we are breaking uh, record profits daily. My most recent call, in fact it is not the most recent, but uh, since today uh, we had more uh, announcements uh, after hours. Congratulations in uh, Twitter. This call in Twitter, it is uh, simply wonderful. Recorded live, calling the top after hours at $71. With a crash all the way down today to a price after hours below $50. Bear in mind that uh, the reason for this presentation today, it is a very important uh, event that I called already two years and a half ago. And that is, uh, for those that they have been with me uh, since then, this wonderful call in Akamai. Akamai today, uh, it was one of the best gainers uh, in the stock market. Unlike uh, Twitter, uh, our bet on Twitter, it was on the short side, and our bet in Akamai on the long side. I've been calling Akamai, my friends, during the past two years and a half to $58. And even last year in 2013, I told you that this stock was worth $58. And although uh, probably some of you believe that uh, the 52 and a half last year could be the top, I told you no. And uh, you have the best gainer in the market or one of the best today, along with uh, Green Mountain Coffee, other terrific call and in, publish it to our uh, website. Uh, Akamai, $58. And uh, the, I'm going to show you the price uh, uh, after hours. This is the price 57 and 80 cents, uh, the price after hours live in Akamai. Akamai, one of the best uh, gainers uh, in the stock market. And uh, the most important for you to understand those that they are or they have been out. It was the process. The process since the bottom in 2011, three years ago, uh, a bottom, a multi-year bottom that I called in and I said that would correspond to a multi-year bottom. And bear in mind that to follow the crash in Akamai, uh, so I upgraded the stock basically in 2011 to strong by long term, never to sell the stock. And uh, the stock then uh, in 2012, all these uh, uh, pivots that you are uh, looking at, I call them, namely the $28 and a half in 2012 as the ultimate bottom, and it was. And in 2013, the most important of them all, the 33 uh, and a half region as the uh, bottom, and then a huge gap to the upside. Uh, you all remember this, to $50, and since then the stock uh, basically it has been uh, consolidating on a mid-term basis, as you can see, and then a new 50-week high, uh, finally to $58, as you all know that was going likely to happen one day, and therefore you had to remain invested uh, a very large amount in Akamai. Since uh, this stock... It has been one of our uh, secrets, but also addressed in our uh, website and blog uh, for those that they uh, are following up. Um, and today I'm very happy because uh, I have not yet missed one single call. Uh, today we had uh, other wonderful uh, uh, calls in the market and all of them published uh, in our website. So I'm going to show you this uh, video on demand. Here you have the Twitter Q4 2014 earnings and after earnings for those that they uh, intend to continue uh, trading Twitter. Here you have clear uh, instructions and a testimonial, a review in Twitter. One of uh, the individuals also in the uh, uh, platinum service. Moreover, um, I believe that is also important because today I received several emails and I published uh, all of them here on the video on demand, this uh, part, and then uh, in uh, 
by clicking on examples that I'm doing right now. So in Akamai long term, that has been basically a 300% return on investment. And that is obviously the very minimum. Uh, the stock was not going to be uh, Netflix, the 700% gain, but nevertheless, uh, a triple digit return of investment, as uh, I always said that it will be the case. And moreover, I uh, continue saying that, um, hold on a second, here you have examples. Uh, this is a video wall for those that they register. And by clicking on, on reviews, you can read it here, some of the reviews I received today. Regarding Expedia, regarding Akamai, regarding uh, Twitter, and the other one regarding Twitter, and finally one regarding LinkedIn earnings. It was also today, and you can show you uh, LinkedIn uh, after hours. This is the price probably 205 or so, we'll see, 206 and 40 cents. So a wonderful uh, calling LinkedIn also, uh, where you find visual instructions very clear. They are wonderful. They were absolutely perfect, in fact, calling the, the pivots that I've been, in fact, uh, uh, creating um, in, in LinkedIn. Uh, stock that I recommended to sell uh, in 2013 at uh, 244 uh, to 248 and then downgrading the stock at 252 dollars precisely. So the stock fell uh, since then 50 dollars uh, as you can see. Uh, so uh, uh, all calls they have been perfect. Although that has not been my objective to make all these calls, uh, they don't have to be uh, all perfect, but it has been the case. And obviously I'm quite happy for uh, these uh, uh, results and the fact that you are uh, sharing your experience with others. Uh, I would like also to show you the fact that uh, when you visit uh, the video on demand lessons that they are available by clicking on blog for those that they are not registered. You find out that, for example, the individual that made uh, 130,000 US dollars in Expedia, he paid, uh, I believe, if you search here, around $900 for the lesson. And other, ah, by the way, now that I'm uh, uh, looking at this, Yelp, uh, Stock Outlook 2014. This is other terrific call that I made in Yelp. Everyone was buying Twitter. We were selling Twitter and the long position and then selling short the stock. The stock uh, crashed, plunged, as you all know by now. And Yelp uh, today traded above $90.00 as I call it, and you have here, if you click, you can see that there was a call, a free call for all that, those that they follow my blog. And in fact, I'm tired of giving millions of dollars in, in profits for free. Um, that I, disclosing that I, uh, I invested in, uh, in Yelp. So you also find the Yelp Stock Outlook 2014 for <laughs> $700 or so. That is completely ridiculous. So the stream stock outlook 2014, 14, we have the single best track record in the world in, uh, the, in uh, so the stream. How to invest in Twitter stock uh, after Q4 earnings, uh, green stock, uh, green mountain coffee stock outlook 2014, absolutely perfect. Here you find live uh, calls in in uh, in green mountain coffee. How to be a millionaire trading Twitter stock, uh, the next potential best buy bubble to collapse uh, probably next year in 2015 <laughs> for those that uh, uh, intend to, uh, to know uh, which might be the stock. Uh, last call, Tesla Motors, uh, you have Salesforce stock outlook, uh, Vieira trading uh, outlook reviews. Well, basically you find here every single uh, piece of information that is necessary 
to be a billionaire investing a small account, a small amount and by the way then i do recommend to one and this is has to be very clear for all of you that you uh, subscribe to a live service besides the uh, video on demand lessons because i see many people uh, renting video on demand lessons but you have not some of you or probably i would say most of you have not attended the trading courses and you will see that there is a huge difference between those that they invest in the, the live service and the trading courses compared to those that they just rent the lessons because those that they just rent the lessons you are not used to the methodology and i believe that uh, some of you might have not have experience sufficient experience to deal with some of the volatility but the guidelines for example in twitter they were extraordinarily i mean it was impossible to find better the move that the stock was going to see so uh, uh, you know it is all there and it was all available in a call that is worth millions of dollars it was all available for one thousand dollars imagine so that mistake i will not repeat again obviously the price of the lessons it will increase considerable not only because the demand uh, it justifies in the sense that uh, the profits they are uh, absolutely i mean they are regular in fact they this is uh, every single year for the past 20 years it has been like this except probably the first 40 years where i developed the methodology and uh, i do recommend finally if you wish to decrease the price of the video on demand lessons and the dubai investors air show um, and all that uh, i do recommend to you that you share with others because by sharing with others even if you rent the lesson you can then receive a refund and or you can invest then in a live service or whatever but you find i repeat in uh, the pricing um, and obviously this is for those savvy traders and investors that they are willing to uh, use their brains and the information that is um, uh, available to them because there are people that they just you know even if i uh, tell them how to make one million they will not make it no matter what because uh, they just refuse to listen to or to learn and they prefer for instance to buy uh, twitter at 70 dollars because just goldman sachs that uh, uh, goldman sachs said that was a strong buy but those idiots, they deserve entirely to lose their accounts. Um, so here you find the, the pricing and here you find the discount that you can obtain. 95%, 99% and it is very clear here, daily pass, daily uh, Dubai Air Show and the number of viewers and everything. And why start sharing now? So everything is available, the information for you to be to learn that is the aim of the service always to teach you how to invest in stock market instead of you relying on others including myself for you to do it yourself and uh, if you want to invest in your education fine if you don't want to invest in your education you have always the wall street analysts to ask their opinion about what the stock market is going to do and in that case i'm happy with that because we have been always happy for 20 years. So if we have been happy for 20 years, I believe that we are going to continue being happy for the rest of our lives, my friends. We have the single best track record in the world in all these stocks that we discuss here. And, you know, this is the reality and nothing can change. So I, let, I leave you, uh, all of you, with this wonderful process in Akamai that took... Uh, uh, well, three years, three years, but uh, we have a long history in Akamai, in fact, uh, we, we also uh, bet on the crash before, um, a stock that no one wanted in the end, um, and it has been volatile, but, uh, you know, it satisfies, it is a pleasure to, to, have, to have participated in this, uh, and to define all the bottoms in the end that I told you that is not about how much one can make but uh, to define those bottoms as uh, great uh, investment opportunities where all people that obviously they have been invested in Akamai on the short side they uh, uh, they went bankrupt 
as uh, you know that was going to happen because this stock was worth 58 dollars uh, at least so this is the price that you get in akamai um, while the idiots that they have been following you remember that now that you are looking at uh, uh, linkedin linkedin uh, when the stock was 250 dollars i still remember that they i informed the subscribers that analysts they were going to upgrade the stock to $300 a few days later they upgraded the stock to $300 and I said my friends this stock is a strong sell the stock is going to sell and the stock sold so the stock sold uh, to $200 it's not the first time that uh, it does it did does it uh, the stock uh, ahead of earnings today it was $223.80 and it is now 205. Uh, so those that they have been buying the stock, believing that uh, it was going to be $300, you fully deserve your losses because uh, LinkedIn, it was not uh, Netflix. I never told you that LinkedIn was going to be Netflix. If you wanted to do a single best stock in the world, I told you already two years ago that was the case with Netflix. So you have been wasting your time in Apple, in uh, whatever stock, it does not matter. That it was the single best stock in the world and it you had, I don't know, since then what, uh, 700 days to buy the stock. So my friends, what you want? Even uh, I published it on the website, the Netflix Stock Outlook 2014. You had plenty of time, as other people they did, to uh, buy, the to rent the lesson. And to make, you know, in a matter of one week, the minimum and the very minimum, unless, I mean, you are a fool without a, a minimum brain, uh, $100,000. I mean, tell me how is possible a stock that moves $100 uh, in one week uh, per share? How is possible that uh, one does not make, uh, you know, less than $100,000? Uh, Just tell me, because I like to understand. I mean, I would like to understand how it's possible someone not to make a very minimum of $100,000 in Netflix within one week. I just, I, I mean, it's, for me, I, you can come with, you know, whatever reasons. For me, it's all excuses. It's the same situation with this Akamai. I mean, the stock was going to be 58. So you had 47, what is not good? 50 is not good, what, uh, 35 is not good, so people had plenty of time to invest and to buy Akamai, the upside, the target, it was 58, that's what you have, it's simple, there is nothing else to be said, my friends, this is continuous, I've been doing this for 20 years, why is it going to miss or to fail next uh, next day or, or, or next year, I mean, I've been... Uh, People, there are some people that they have been, what, trying to uh, fool themselves. This is not going to fail. It is impossible to go back 20 years ago to when the point where we started. People are, m many people are stupid. They believe in Wall Street. Wall Street, uh, LinkedIn, $300, you have $200. That is what you have. I mean, if you wanted to invest and if you wanted to make $1 million overnight, without any sort of problems, you had, or without any risk whatsoever, you had yesterday the case in Twitter. I mean, I don't understand quite frankly how it's possible not to make the same situation like in, uh, in, um, in Netflix. I don't understand personally how it's possible one person not to make $1 million. I mean, you don't have capital. You have a small account. Okay, I show you an account with 15,000 US dollars, 15,000, I repeat, and with, ma with one month, you get, or one month or two months, you make 100%. So, if, and this is not about options, I'm against options trading. Okay, so I have been uh, repeating this, I think, more than 10,000 times in the past years, I don't trade options, I'm against options trading. Options is for idiots, it's for fools. It's for those that they invented the options in, in the United States. They don't know what they are talking about. They don't even know what the option is. They believe that they know what uh, options and how to trade options. They are so, These guys are so idiots that they, they say it's amazing. 
you talk to one of these guys and start making questions, and the guys, they believe that they know about options because they read the books, those that they, you know, they, they sell the most, and they, they, they come out with uh, uh, strategies amazing in formulas, and, you know, they invest by formulas and uh, algorithms, and they don't fucking know what a fucking option is, my friends. Anyway, today, uh, um, Akamai, uh, basically 58, LinkedIn, uh, as you can see, 206, but not only that, uh, you know, uh, I, Twitter, uh, this other uh, Expedia today, after hours, at a new 52-week high, 74, the, you also find uh, the Expedia uh, stock outlook in my own website. My friends, I have not missed one single, one, one, I'm, one, I, I'm, I'm sure that I'm going to miss one, but, uh, you know, one. So, yesterday, by the way, Green Mountain Coffee, yesterday it was $131, you remember after hours, $131, well, today it is $102 for some reason, <laughs> maybe someone sold, but do you remember that fund manager in the US, uh, David Highhorn, the Highhorn case, my friends, the Highhorn that he remained bearish, this stock uh, all the way up to a new 52-week high, a new all-time high. So I'm going to show you the chart just for your uh, guidance, for you to visualize. This is nice. I like to go back to these things, you see. So uh, you remember this crash in uh, Green Mountain Coffee? And if you want to know where the button is in Green Mountain Coffee, I have that recorded live. $17.80, my friends. $17.80, it was the button here in July 2012, the button that you find in the demo of one of my services, the Platinum, the best trading system in the world. And since then, the stock started doing this. And then recently, in 2013, I call it the button once again at $58 an hour. And then Coca-Cola decided that they wanted to uh, uh, enter or purchase a stake or whatever in Green Mountain Coffee. And yesterday, after hours, the stock went all the way up to $131 or so. So, this to say what? That the idiot, the American fund manager that everyone has been praising as the great investor and fund manager in the US, and I, we have been writing on the blog, not only my blog, but the Beyond Trading blog, as one of the great losers, my friends. If that is the truth. He's one of the great losers. The guy not only lost millions of dollars in Apple, as he lost millions or hundreds of millions, or in fact, that is a, a, a fact, uh, the, the, the uh, bullish gold, as now the guy lost, blew up his entire account, uh, short Green Mountain Coffee. And this is one of the reasons I never recommended to uh, remain or to be short the stock, except once in 2013, and that was the 87 all the way down to $58 an half, because... The guy didn't uh, quit, and because the guy didn't de quit, he had to quit, and he quit uh, uh, blowing up entirely the account. So this is what happens to those that they believe in, uh, you know, the great fools, uh, the great fund managers in Wall Street that they have not proven any, anything 21, 21, including to themselves. But they have to be uh, fund managers, and why they have to be fund managers? It's very simple, my friends. They have to be fund managers. They don't trade their accounts. Because they have to be fund managers. What is, what is the reason to be a fund manager? It to sell the idea to someone else and you gain a commission of, on that. If I am a great investor, if I am a great trader, I mean, the only thing, I trade my account, right? Why am I going to be a fund manager? I mean, do you understand? The, I mean, I said I don't understand how it's possible, why I would be a fund manager if I can trade my own account. I don't understand. So, I mean, I, this is not uh, uh, logic. I think it is very logic, but people know. He is a fund manager, he has great ideas, I'm going to put there my fucking money and he's going to, you know, I'm going to make fucking triple digit returns. Yeah, sure, you are fucking bankrupt, right? So show me the statements to, uh, show, me to show, uh, show me the money. Show me the fucking money, show me the truth. You understand what I'm saying? So my friends, these, these calls that I made, and yesterday, by the way, in Green Mountain Coffee, although I, I suspected about this, that's going to, hap to happen 
uh, because I was looking at the day before the earnings announcement. So uh, uh, one could not be short this stock because there were a lot of buyers yesterday. The announcement, it was already there. So the tape uh, tells the truth. Always the tape, my friends. is not about the real-time news and you know what is coming on TV. It's the tape. The news, they were already there. The people, uh, those that obviously, uh, they, were, they knew already about this uh, uh, was going to, to happen, except the, the idiot and the others that they were short stock. Of course, it can happen to anyone. No, 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 no. I mean, what I'm saying here that is important as a lesson is uh, anyone can fail. Anyone can fail in the sense that uh, uh, anyone can have a loss, an open loss, and then it, he, he has to learn how to deal with it. And there are several strategies and tactics for that. But what I'm referring to, it is completely different. What I'm referring to is the fact that the individual has seen or any one short Green Mountain Coffee for six or eight or nine months, you have seen continuously that the individual didn't quit. And besides he didn't quit, he continu continuously made bearish calls about Green Mountain Coffee. And in my opinion, that was, it has been the key for this stock to go from $17.80 all the way up to yesterday to $130 with a finally an analyst today upgrading to $150. So the question is where were the analysts when Green Mountain Coffee was downgraded? Do you remember Green Mountain Coffee was downgraded in July 2012? Uh, they were downgrading the stock to $13 an hour. You don't, you don't believe me? Search Google, Google, the great investment of our times. Yeah, Google, yes. Google, Google, why Google? Because Google tells you the truth. It's because the US government, it is there probably an office, right? My friends, this has been all explained during the past, I don't know, 10 years. Our investment in Google started at $97 IPO price. It is $1,160. And by the way, you find about all this in the best... Uh, blog in the world, in my personal opinion, that is this one that is going to open, and blog.beyond-trading.com, and this is the blog that is, you are, uh, it is uh, loading, Twitter stock crash, what you need to know, and more lessons, more information, all here, available basically for free. You have this blog started in 2009. Here you find, uh, you know, I don't know how many stocks you have there or everything. And uh, here you have, you see, uh, plenty of calls, videos, you know, 300 and 400. There are more than 500 articles here for all of you. And uh, what is interesting about this um, is some of the, you know, that the some of the most... Uh, um, uh, Posts that we or the, the, the more views uh, is about this. Uh, I, I have a lot of views about uh, Zach's investment research. Uh, uh, people searching on the, the, the Google for the scams. Zach's uh, motley fool. Um, that one, that individual, I don't remember now, uh, and I, I'm happy not to remember his name. Um, that he blew up the account of everyone by uh, telling people to invest in Fusion and in other stock, in other company also that you find here. Anyway, I'm not very good with names, as you all know. I forget about all names. I'm only good with numbers, unfortunately. So, but you find here all the information about, you know, all these companies. And I have a lot, many, many case studies coming uh, in Yoiko, in, uh, you know, Chinese companies selling China before the collapse. Wonderful things, wonderful opportunities. Lulu a wonderful crash. Um, you know, it's all here and I'm going to publish by far more. In fact, I don't have time. Um, and uh, here you have uh, how to invest in Twitter after Q4 earnings. Wonderful, wonderful. It is all there for those that they continue. And bear in mind, this is all about the process, you see. We published one video, and after an event like earnings, we continue. 
and we give information. So everything is there, it is uh, available, and the things they were in fact already described. So people, they continue, and we continue updating and giving all the information that is necessary for investors to follow up and to continue making the most. And I wanted to leave you with, the, the of course, well, the Akamai that is gone. It meanwhile gave uh, uh, <laughs> place to Twitter. Uh, but uh, I wanted also to show you one thing that I believe it is, uh, I mean, this is for uh, your uh, Yelp. Let's click on Yelp to see what's come up. Come, uh, what's what's going to happen? I think that uh, I hope to see uh, Yelp here. Yelp stock outlook uh, strong buy. So let's click here, and uh, I invite you. Uh, just uh, I have to leave. I invite you to uh, read about this, okay? Because I mean <laughs> it says it all. You understand? Yelp stock outlook uh, strong buy. Uh, the says Wall Street analysts are a bunch of fools. Okay, I, I mean, you understand, you don't, the rest you can read, but this is, it says everything. So, the, everyone was bearish, not everyone, but most of them, they were bearish uh, Yelp, and Yelp jumped at $20 per share. And everyone was bullish Twitter, you remember all these recent upgrades in Twitter. I mean, they did, they, 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 the funny thing about Twitter is that they were all bearish, when the stock was a strong buy on IPO, the $40 all the way up to 75 And then, uh, I mean, uh, while I speak, uh, I, obviously I have to show you, otherwise, uh, you know, some of you might uh, have problems to visualize these things. And it is interesting that you always refer, I cannot show you the charts, obviously my own charts, the, the, those are confidential. But uh, the interesting is uh, everyone started to be interested about Twitter, when the analysts they started upgrading the stock, you see, so uh, everyone buys the stock at the top. You see the volumes, the volumes. Everyone buys the stock at the top. No one predicted, except myself, that I made that call and it is live recorded here. When the stock it was uh, seventy three dollars. I I remember it is live. I recorded this. Uh, then the stock plunged, and then uh, uh, you see that the Wall Street has been buying the stock and the, all the upgrades. Not all of them, because there are analysts that are bearish, in fact, but those that they are bearish, they were idiots because they missed entirely the rally. And by missing the rally, they sold short the stock and they are still uh, underwater. So idiots, they continue or they prevail. And so the single best way to trade Twitter on both sides of the market, it has been with my calls, the 40, in fact, below all the way up to 75. That is why you have, in fact, on my one website, an image, a very clear one, with Amazon to $400 and uh, Twitter to 75 And then uh, everyone that has been uh, greedy, the greedy bastards, they bought, they loaded up uh, Twitter. <laughs> oh, Twitter is going to $80, my friend. Yay, $80. You wanted $80. I give you the fucking $80. Whoa! Pull it back to the fucking carpet and you all are down uh, overnight uh, $21 per share. That is to say, you fucking blew up your account and you, where is your money? It's fucking here and in our subscribers' uh, wallet. And that is where it has to be. People that they use their fucking brains is not those fucking idiots that they don't know what they are talking about. And uh, my friends, now call Goldman Sachs, call those, uh, you know, uh, I don't know the name of all, all of them saying, my friends, I want my money back. You said Twitter to $80 or $75 and I a minute long. I put there my fucking money. Options trading, options trading. You are gone. You understand? The, my friends, you, I have been teaching here how to trade. The, the, I recommend to you, I do recommend to you because, I mean, this is going to save your life, Okay. This is going to save your life if you want to be an investor is that you uh, um, rent the lesson about the Twitter uh, yesterday uh, recorded live um, because my friends, if you don't rent the lesson just for, I, I don't have any personal issue with that but one thing I can assure you is that you are not going ever 
to figure out a stock that goes up 300% like uh, Akamai. You will never understand how or why a stock like Netflix went up 700%. You will not ever do anything. And one day, even if you are happy this week or next month or next year because you made whatever, you know, some uh, good investments, the next year or after five years, you are bankrupt, you are gone, and it's going to happen to you because that is mathematics. It is mathematics and against mathematics, you cannot do anything, my friend, because I already proved this for 20 years. You see, I already studied this since my childhood, my friends. It is all here. It is about visions. It's not about what you think that is going to happen. I read the market. So if I read the market, it's about reading the market. It's not about, uh, uh, you know, uh, analyst targets. Uh, Twitter to 80, Twitter to 40, Twitter to e this, Twitter to that. It's not this. Is to know exactly what the matter, ma market is going to do and to predict the brute changes of sentiment and by predicting in real time, not only in real time, in, in the Twitter case, it was, I defined that the reason for the reversal, for the crash, it will be the $68 and a half to 71. It is there. It is recorded live, written, uh, sorry, recorded live uh, in on video two weeks in advance. Two weeks for all of you available for $1,000, my friends. So uh, if you want to know about uh, level two and the most important tool on the planet for all those that they are you know, those that are serious about investment, about trading, that tool is called the tape, okay? It costs, I think is $10 per month or whatever, a subscription NASDAQ, our partner. So you log into their website, you pay $10 and that is all you need. Don't waste your fucking money on real-time news or, you know, to Reuters or Bloomberg or watching TV because you are wasting your time. I never then did, only to figure out that when I do it is just to, well, there are reasons in fact to do it, is to, to catch some contrarian plays and some idiots like we do it in SeekingAlpha.com that is probably the worst site in the planet for investors. Uh, that is where I got also the OCZ technology. Uh, you all remember OCZ technology, right? OCZ technology, uh, the collapse, $10 all the way down to zero. Okay, and today you have a penny stock, but you already knew that was going to happen in 2012. It is there on the website, it is everywhere. It is on YouTube, you have videos. My friends, today if you are not a millionaire, the question is, what the fuck have you been doing? That is the first question that you have, been, that you have to, uh, to make to yourself. What the fuck have you been doing? Where, where have you been? In on YouTube, uh, you are uh, uh, listening to uh, Kramer, uh, buy soda stream at $72 and then stock crashes and then Kramer says no now it is not good the fuck no 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 but it was good at 72 it's not good at 40 or 33 or 35 but at 72 it is good it's the case like in beer Stearns $58 beer Stearns fuck this is an investment of our lives Kramer Kramer we are here Kramer what do you think Alex trust me Buy the fucking beer stands. You are not going to regret. Shit. Let me see the fucking CEO speaking there on TV. I saw the fucking CEO speaking there on TV. And that, in fact, it is the use of the TV on, on that day. There are, so I'm telling there are things that you should, but you have to know what. It's not the Reuters news. It's the, you know, to look people uh, on their eyes. And uh, I saw that the guy was lying. I mean, on TV. Bjorn Stearns is good, is good, we are good, we are good, our, we, our statements, you know, everything is fine, fine, good, good, not, not Lehman Brothers, we, no, 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 you know, the fucking guy was fucking lying, all, the, all those, all those fucking minutes, my friends, short, Gligram, short Bjorn Stearns all the way down, six dollars and a half, I still fucking remember it, I mean, it was already what, uh, you know, I don't know, Many years ago, many years ago. And meanwhile, you had the single best bull market in a decade that you also find here, by the way. And then now that you are doing this, is, is, this is fine. We're already in 40 minutes long. And uh, the best bull market in a decade, you find here the case study. 
uh, if you go, if you click on Vieira work, there is a case study that says the best bull market in a decade. And it is the best bull market in a decade that you have got in the past few years and uh, an investment in one of the best two companies, in fact, uh, that you all remember. Um, that is the case with Biogen and uh, the case with uh, um, the other company that is Amgen. So it is all there, my friends. It is all there. <laughs> all other, other companies that you had plenty of time, you are going to see plenty of time uh, in... Um, in Amgen to invest, and you obviously you have to, uh, you know, to search for, you see Amgen, see a button, this is a multi-year button that I call it in, from this, uh, the $48.52, and the stock exploded, and uh, all this, according to that case study, and you had plenty of time to invest in these um, the companies, because they were some of the best investments in the, the biotech sector, you see. Uh, 2010, $50, 48 the same situation like in 2009, and the stock today, it, it is trading above $300. I mean, it is there, it is on the website, it is there, what, what I mean, it's like Netflix, what, what, do you, what, what did you want? You understand? So, um... Obviously, Kramer uh, <laughs> was not bullish this one, my friends. Kramer was bullish Netflix uh, before the crash. You remember when a few years ago at three, uh, it was at 200 and uh, it is, there is a video on the net. Uh, there is a video, it was $285 or 89 uh, and the guy uh, was saying to buy uh, or 295 or something like that. And the guy was saying to invest to $400 and Netflix crashes all the way down to 50 to 86. And then, yes, after Kram quits, we invested in Netflix. But the stock was at crash. It was not a buy, my friends. We are not here to help Kramer. Kramer is working for us. That is different. That is the beauty of the system. We have Kramer there working for us, although he uh, does not know about it. Well, you never know if in the end he's a subscriber or not, right? So, I leave you with Google <laughs> and thank you very much. Congratulations. Don't forget about Akamai. Thank you.